ABO's vitriol solvent-based paints were designed to mimic the look of true stained glass, blown glass, or fused glass without the expense and difficulty of working with those materials. The range of colors are brilliant, intense, and very highly pigmented. There are 26 colors, four of which are opaque in nature. In addition, there is a lightening medium and a glitter medium. To coincide with those products, there are seven dimensional outliners called Serin Relief that are used to place the design on your glass piece. When working on a piece of glass, we recommend that you first use a solvent to wipe off any fingerprints. Secondly, it's a good idea to use a simple level to be sure that your work area is very level because the paints are in fact very fluid and the paints will run into the corner. To place the design on your piece of glass, you can place a pattern underneath and then there are two means to apply the design to the glass. One is by using the actual self-adhesive lead strips that come in a strip of actual lead. You simply cut this off, you remove the adhesive backing and you place it firmly onto the glass, pressing it down to be sure that it's snug and secure. The second method to place your design on the glass is by using the Serin Relief Outliner. You simply remove the cap and you place your design on the surface of the glass. This will take about 10 minutes to dry before you add the color to the piece. Once you've applied your design, we will then take our colors and we will apply the color to the glass. Before you add the color, it is a good idea to lighten the color, and there are two ways to lighten color. The first is by adding white to the color that is existing from the Betrayal Solvent Based paint line. If you add white, that will increase the opacity of the color. Instead of adding white, I have added the medium called Lightening Medium. I've added approximately 50% medium to this lemon yellow color. And as you can see, it's still very, very bright and intense in its pigment. You can apply the color with either an eyedropper, a brush, or a toothpick. Once I've applied the color completely, I'm going to go in with the technique that I call Starburst and a very small eyedropper. I will drop several drops of a secondary color in here. And with my toothpick tool, I will come in and I will drag the colors out very simply to create what I call a starburst effect. It's very easy to create marbleized effects as well by adding a bit of white opaque color. And that's what I've done here in these corners with a gold and a white. Once you've completed your painting, you're going to want to allow this surface to dry for six to eight hours before moving it as the paint will tend to shift. With the Betrayal Solvent Based Paints, you can create many beautiful and brilliant pieces for your home. Take a look over here. We've created a pretty stained glass effect light bulb. You can simply place this in your lamp, put a white lampshade on, and you've created a stained glass effect piece for your home. With Vitrail Solvent Based Paints, the possibilities are endless for creating beautiful, vibrant, intense pieces to place in transparent locations in your home. Thank you much.